What's up guys? Um today I'm gonna show you guys how to um make muzzle flares and blood sprays and um Windows Live Movie Maker. And um I'm pretty sure that Windows Live Movie Maker is like the worst movie making program. Um but I did figure out that you can make um muzzle flares in it. So here's how you do it. Um you take your video and um you find the frame where you're getting shot. Let me drag through. Okay, so I come in and there's like, right there. I'm like, oh, okay, I wanna get shot here. So um, you're going to go to edit, split. Unfortunately, I already split this video, so I can't do that. But, um, and then once it's split into the two video clips, um, you're gonna hit this little button on your screen, uh, or your keyboard, um, there it is, it says, like, part screen, or something like that, um, P-R-T-S-C-R-S-E-R-N, um, and so, it will seem like nothing happens, but then you'll go to, you're gonna go to paint, um, okay, and, um, you're gonna hit control V, Whoa. Shoot. Sorry about that. Um, I had something else copied, so uh, let me try that again. There we go. Okay, so now you see the usefulness of that part screen button. Because I'm in paint right now, but this is what I have. Because um, there you can see like the paint screen. So um, then you're going to go up on paint. Uh, let me zoom in. You're going to go up to the selection, um, and you're going to select rectangular selection. You're going to go down to your video, and you're going to select as much of it as you want. Okay, so there we go. And um, then you're going to hit crop. So now that's what you have. So you're going to save that. I'll do save as I die, which I already have it saved, so I'm not going to do it, but you save it as whatever you want. Um, and then you want to open up your, um, your like photo editing program. So I have GIMP. Um, you can go to www.gimp.com to download it. Um, you're going to hit file, open, new folder. I saved mine. It's just I die. Uh, let me find it. Uh, here we go. I die. Oh, wait, shoot. Sorry. Um, shoot. Okay, um, unfortunately, I'm going to have to do a different one because I uh, didn't save that. But, so... God. Alright, sorry about this. Um, I'm going to have to go back to paint. And, um save this as something else so save as okay just have it saved as something random so now you're gonna open up GIMP okay there it is let me zoom out for you guys uh, okay you're gonna go to file open you're gonna open up your um, your new image okay so there's my image um, now for it you're gonna hit file open and you wanna go on just Google and get like a good blood spray. So there's mine. Um, let me move this toolbox for you. So there's mine. So now you're gonna hit edit, copy. You can just close out of this. And you're gonna go to your picture and hit edit, paste. Doesn't matter where on the picture you paste it. So now, before you do anything else, you want to go to colors. You're going to have an option that says colors on it. Colors. And then you're going to go down to color to alpha. Um, you might have to click on this little box here. And there will be a dropper. And if there's a black background up here, then you're going to, right here, then you're going to have to take the dropper, put it on the black background, and put it right here. Um, and that will get you this background. So you hit OK. And now, as you can see, um, the blood spray is, like, on there. So um, I just put a dot on my blood spray. But 
So now you can just goof around with it. Um, obviously you want to scale it down. So let me scale this way down. Okie dokie, scale. Uh, you can rotate it. There it is. Rotate. Move it. Okay. So, well, I can't move it anymore, but so there's my blood spray. Um, and now you're just gonna hit File, Save As. You're gonna save it as your picture. Just hit Replace when it pops up. Um, hit Save. Okay, it's saved. Now you're gonna go to Windows, Movie Maker. Um, go to the part where the screens are split. And go to Home, Add Videos and Photos. Um, and I have a bunch of them on there, but I, I, I. That will pop up. And now you want to go to edit, and the duration will say 7 seconds. Um, I recommend doing 0.3 seconds. That's a pretty good length. So now you'll see what my uh, video looks like. Hey, could you come here for a second? Sorry, you just got to back up. But as, as you can see there, um, the blood spray appeared. So that's how to make a blood spray on Windows Movie Maker. I hope this I hope this was helpful.